John, I say uh, two 0 win here at Bournemouth today. Um, couldn't have gone much better, really, could it? No, not really. Um, it was a solid performance from the lads. I'm really proud of them. Um, I was just saying to, to them after the game. Since uh, we came in last week, the standards have been exceptional. Uh, every day in training, and the two games that we've played, they've been, they've been outstanding. I couldn't have asked for any more. Um, and it was a solid performance today. You know, it was a tough game, uh, but I thought we defended brilliantly when we needed to, um, and we pressed them when we, we needed to at the right times and won the ball back, which we'd worked on. And um, you know, we got the result in the end and a clean sheet, which is very pleasing. We we'll just start on that um, defensive performance. Um, obviously, there's a big moment uh, in the first half of Alex Whitmore's um, kind of last second tackle. Um, there's always kind of moments together, and just a, I guess a great defensive performance. Yeah, I uh, worked a little bit with the centre halves there at training last week, and they, they, they were sol I mean, they didn't really cause us any real problems. No one was opening us up. No one was being a real threat to us throughout the game. Um, Never, you know, they've got two really good strikers that can cause problems, and every time that the strikers were receiving the ball, they were, you know, they were right up tight, not giving them a, a, any space whatsoever. So no, it, it was a real solid performance from the defence, and uh, really pleasing. And to the other end of the pitch, and obviously the dead that was broken probably for an unlikely source, wasn't it? Yeah, um, yeah. I think they put the centre off up there, further up the pitch at the end, and we, we sort of stayed how we were. And we seemed to get quite a lot of counters towards the end, counter attacks. And it was just a, um, I think we found ourselves three on three at the end and worked it all right. And yeah, that, that sealed the points. In terms of the, uh, the goals itself, obviously Andy Taylor's run was quite a spectacular effort. Um, yeah. Did you see that coming from him? Uh, well, he's got it in his locker, yeah. But um, I think he was quite shocked himself from his reaction after he did it. Uh, but no, it was a great strike and uh, put us 1 0 in, in front, which is important. Uh, and no, it was, like I say, it was, a, it was an excellent goal. We'll see with uh, two wins, two wins and two now, and a bit of momentum rolling into Tuesday night. How important will that be to, with obviously such a short period of time, to take that on? Yeah, there's no better time to have another game now. You know, the, the lads are starting to believe in what we're trying to do. We've said to them at half time today, because um, I think there was a spell in the first half where we stopped getting on the ball and stopped passing it, and, and that's when the, the game sort of went against us. So we sort of spoke to them at half time just to say, look, you got to really believe in, in yourselves and, and, and what you're doing and they, they did that second half and you know that, that um, them believing in themselves is vital and, and that, that's coming now and I'm sure with a result like that today uh, Tuesday couldn't come quick enough for us yeah